Now, having a beautiful smile is just one way to feel better about yourself. How we live each day has a profound effect, not just on our health and well-being, but how we age as well. I spoke with two doctors who say they have a manual for how to live younger and longer. Have you ever wondered why some 60-year-olds look and feel like 40-year-olds and why some 40-year-olds look and feel like 60-year-olds? Well, today I'm talking to Nobel Prize winner Dr. Elizabeth Blackburn and Dr. Alyssa Eppel about a revolutionary approach to living younger, healthier, and longer. Doctors, thank you so much for being with us. Thank you for having us. Thank you. Now, I know we're talking about something, is it called a telomere? Am I saying it right? You are. Tell me more about this. Well, uh, think of a shoelace, and a uh, shoelace needs protective tips. Well, a shoelace is a little bit like our DNA. It also needs to have protective tips because the DNA has all of our genetic material in it and it protects all of our cells and makes us work properly. So what we don't want for a shoelace is to have the shoelace end look like this. This is not going to work. And in the same way, it won't work for our DNA. And so what we found is that telomeres are really important for our health as human beings as we go through our lives because when they don't work properly like this, when they're frayed, then the cells can't replenish themselves properly throughout our lives and that makes us more prone to the diseases that afflict us more and more uh, of aging. But the great news is that this is something that we have control over. Yes, and so there are many things that we do every day, little things that add up over time and can stabilize our telomeres and keep them healthy throughout the decades. <laughs> so uh, we know that, that certain foods that we eat, how well we sleep, how long we sleep, and how we respond to stress are all really important. So if we're under a lot of stress, that can shorten them early in life. But if we're, for example, we're really active, um, you know, about 10 minutes a day of vigorous activity, that protects people under stress. It's very important for people under stress. Other resilience factors, um, eating whole foods diets, these fruits and vegetables and whole grains are much better for telomeres than um, over here. Meat, especially processed meat and highly uh, sugared products like sugared soda, these appear to shorten telomeres. And so I know we're looking right behind you. It says living younger, uh, healthier, and longer. So how is it all of these things, doctor, you just talked about, you know, stress, what we eat, how is that all affecting those telomeres and how we can have a better life? Well, uh, it's just one of the things going on that makes us age, this shortening of the telomeres. And uh, a useful thing to remember is that our cells, which has got all our telomeres in it, our cells throughout our body, they're listening to our thoughts. Mm -hmm. And that's because our mind has a lot of control over what goes on in our body, all the way down into our cells, into keeping our telomeres stronger if we can control uh, many aspects of our lives that help keep them robust. Exactly. So it comes down to the small things. There's so many things we can do. We uh, list a lot of things in our book. We have some, we know mind-body breaks are really important. We need to every day take even just a few minutes, calm our nervous system, focus our attention. We have mini meditations on our website. All these little things add up. Choose what matters most to you. Add it to your daily routine. Staple it to a behavior that you already do to make sure that it sticks like a habit. And I know you mentioned that website, doctor. What is that website? Okay, it's telomereeffect.com. T-E-L-O-M-E-R-E -E -E effect, E-F-F-E-C-T.com. Well, this is quite fascinating, ladies. Thank you so much for all the information. Thank you. Thank you so much. Happy New Year. Thank you. Happy New Year. Don't go anywhere in the morning blend. We'll be right back.